sponsor of this video is All Powers, and while the products I will show you today are designed for charging mobile phones, laptops, smartwatches, or powering small AC devices, they can also be very useful for do-it-yourself projects or similar applications. If I do agree to promote something on my channel, I always try to connect it with the channel content. I will never promote something that I don't believe would be useful in certain situations. This YouTube channel is dedicated to development boards based on ESP32 microcontroller and every time I showcase a new ESP32 board I receive many questions about power consumption and many of you want to know how long a battery will be able to power the board before running out. And it is very hard to give a good answer to this question because um, battery consumption depends on many factors. It, it depends on screen size, screen driver, it depends on CPU speed, it depends on peripherals we use, it depends on ESP32 versions, it depends are we using Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, are we using sleep, it depends on our project. However, despite all modifications, tricks and, uh, and optimizations, ESP32 remains power hungry, regardless of which development boards you are using. You can use large batteries, but sometimes even that is not enough to power a device for days without relying on the electrical grid. The device I'm showing you today is All Powers PB100 Portable Power Bank. It can give 100 watts. Uh, has a large battery of 24,000 milliamp hours and yes I have used power banks to power my ESP32 projects before but all powers product products stand out in a few key areas first it looks great next it has a large capacity 24,000 milliamp hours it recharges very fast for some reasons all power banks take many hours to recharge I can recharge this with 100 watts charger. Built-in flashlight with 3 brightness level and SOS mode. A nice belt strap that makes it easy to carry or touch to backpack while hiking or for similar activities. And my favorite feature, it can be recharged with solar power. My version came with this 21 watt solar panel. Make it perfect for off-grid use. And another device is this large, but still compact All Powers S200 portable power bank, which can deliver 200 watts even, even AC. And it also has wireless phone charger. So what can be powered with? 154 watt hours. I know for sure it can power my laptop for four hours because I tried that and I recharged my phone many times. This is great for smaller appliances while you're hiking, camping, when you're somewhere outside. But it can also be used to power our projects and I think this can power some of my projects for months. On all power sites you can find many different models but I decided to use these two because they are affordable compact and I can recharge them with solar panels and they have enough power for my toys. Ok let's finally play with our ESP32 boards and with our power banks. For example here is a project I made for this video. This is beautiful wave share 2.8 board. It has touchscreen, buzzer, real-time clock, chip, SD card, slot, and this beautiful 480 by 640 display. And in this project I have this module which measures voltage and current so we can get power. This is INA219 and we can see that this board is currently consuming 77 milliamp milliamps and voltage is around 5 volts so less than 1 amp and that is a, is exactly what we can see here 5 volts and value is rounded to 100 milliamps 
So this device can power this board for a long time. In uh, this setup of board, board is measuring its own power consumption, its own current and voltage, but it can but I can also connect it differently. So, so now I can use it to measure power consumption of other boards. Just to show you, just to show you how different projects can have different power needs. This is the simplest ESP32 board I have. This is ESP32S3, but it doesn't do anything besides blinking this LED. And we can see that it needs only around 15 milliamps. So, very simple board without too much peripherals, will not need too much current. But check this out. This, this gorgeous WaveShare 5 inch screen, high resolution, large display, brightness and Wi-Fi turn on, will consume almost half of ampere and we can confirm that here but that is still two watts so nothing this great all powers pb100 can't handle That's it. I hope you learned something and I hope I gave you a few ideas. I will uh, um, share this project for this great web share board in link so you can find code there. And I will also share affiliate links for these two all powers devices. So don't forget to check links and subscribe and and everything thank you have a nice day and i will see you next week goodbye